Hi right, folks, this is your XLR 25 LRLE. Nice unit. As you see, you got some outside speakers here. You also have a mount for an additional TV if you so choose. You have a really nice awning that's controlled inside the unit on your control panel. You have a nice rear door that folds down so you can get your toys in there. This is your water heater. Make sure that you fill it with water. Put your plug in, fill it with water. Bleed out your air. Then you can fire it up. Same goes for the electrical switch. You got your black tank flush, fresh water connection, city water connection. These are your vents to your furnace. You can purchase mud dauber screens to cover those so insects don't get in. You also have an outside little water outlet if you need to spray something off. These are all your sewer connections. Hook up your hose, pull your valves. Once again, you can determine the level of the sewer sewer tanks from inside the unit on your control panel. You have some additional storage space up front. Comes with your power cord, your outside uh, little hose here. You also have your sewer hose and your, your adapters for your crank up here. Now this does come equipped with an electrical crank or the jack. Um, but like I said, if sometimes if the battery runs out or something, you might have to end up taking this cover off and manually doing it with the jacks. It does come equipped with a brand new battery and two 20 pound propane tanks, fully, fully charged up, ready to go. Opposite side of the unit, you also have another door that's available for storage and then side of the unit you have a nice little stereo system you have the switch here that controls your air conditioning or your fireplace down here these are really nice to provide extra heat to the unit you also have your awning button in here to extend and retract. Here's your monitor for your furnace and your air conditioner. Refrigerator and freezer. Your microwave, your stove. Uh, to light this stove you want to make sure that your propane is in the on position or open. You want to turn these to the flame, depending on what burner you want to ignite. And then you're gonna turn that button, or turn that here to ignite it. Same thing for the inside of the oven. Obviously you have nice little lights on it. You got your sink. An additional folding table. You got the chairs that in the back of the unit. You also have interior speakers. Fully charged fire extinguisher. Here's your bathroom. You have a nice vent in here just in case you take a shower and the heat builds up and you want to get rid of the heat out of the out of the unit you also have your toilet obviously your shower and into the bedroom nice little bed uh, you also have outlets depending if you want to decide to put a tv in here 
Uh, you also have little areas up front in the bed there, up front in front of the bed to charge your cell phone or your tablet. And that is a quick overview of your new unit. If you have any additional questions, uh, feel free to contact us here at All Seasons RV or you may refer to YouTube. And one last thing I forgot to tell you, this is also your control panel. Uh, you can control your water pump when you're hooked up to fresh water. You also have the button for your propane water heater. Uh, like I said, you can check the status of your battery, your fresh water level, and your sewage, your sewage tanks. Thanks again, and like I said, any questions, feel free to ask us here at All Seasons. Enjoy your camper.